Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Our next stop in the hunt has brought us over to a game which is called SCP Roleplay. Now this is my very first time playing the game and I already made the biggest mistake. I took on this journey and I did it on a solo run. I was successful in completing and getting the badge, but this one took a lot of time. It was a lot of raging a lot of shooting and a lot of pain to complete this badge i'm not gonna lie now in order to successfully complete this badge ladies and gentlemen you have to go through a series of doors and you have to kill a series of faceless zombies now in the scientist facility you have three doors the first two doors are triggered by a electrical box in which you have to fill up the current in order to open up the door. Thus, opening up the door is releasing the zombies. It makes no sense, but you have to do it. And then you have to go through those zombies within the first two doors. Now, the third door is going to require a secret code to access and trigger the door to open. Now, this code I found it is 5747. I don't know if the code is going to be the same for everyone, but just take down that number and write it down somewhere. 5747. That is going to open up the third door within the lab's facility. Once you open up that door, you have a staircase that is going to be leading out of the facility. You're going to take that staircase and you're going to run like hell in the middle of that desert wasteland to a house that is smack dab in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> yes, you're going to run very fast. And the reason why you're running very fast is because there is these giant faceless entities that have no legs. They're literally just crawling around and you cannot kill them. No matter what weapon you have, there is no way to kill them. So I figured that out on a first, you know, hand to hand basis. I ran out there a couple of times, well, not physically running, but I was walking out and they kill you instantly. The first touch that they land on you, they kill you. These are different from the small zombie entities that you were shooting in the lab. Those ones are dealing damage, but they're dealing damage slowly. You know what I'm saying? The bigger ones, instant touch kills you. So I died so many times not learning that on my screen there is a dash button. So yeah, press that and you'll start running faster. And that's all you have to do. You run faster through that desert wasteland, maneuvering around those giant faceless titans. Then you're gonna go up to that house and you're gonna repeat the same sort of process that you did in the facility to open up doors in this house. The first door is gonna require you guys to land the circle within the green marker area. Once you land it there, that door will open up. Then you're going to go through a series of doors that have electrical boxes. You're going to do the same thing that you did within the facility, but in this house. Then you guys are going to find a secret door that is going to release the stairs that leads to a second floor in that house. You're going to want to shoot those stairs to fully expand them. You're going to go up there, you're going to find another secret door, you're going to do the same thing that you did within the lab, fill up the current that triggers the box to open up the door. Then you're going to go down to the uh, basement area in which you're going to have to open up that door, same situation once again, and you're going to retrieve an egg from the basement, ladies and gentlemen. Now, as you are, you know, paying close attention to everything that you're doing you killed so many faceless zombie entities the small ones within the house you probably thought there were no more but once you retrieve the egg from the basement it sends off some sort of alarm and more zombies are rushing in very very fast this time so at this point now you're gonna have to run really really fast through these small faceless zombies and then run back through the desert avoiding the giant faceless zombie titans and back into the facility to give the egg to the scientists but I really am my shit ain't nobody gonna tell me different y'all niggas be looking over y'all shoulders where y'all living no all live that was totally wicked better how i do what i just do
I made my mama proud of me. I hope my mama proud of me. Cause I dubbed college just so I could focus on a dream. I know my mama died of me, salute me, nasty down with me. Now two bros going back and forth, sibling rivalry. Who the sky gotta be? Do numbers like the lottery. The coldest every winter, every summer, nothing hot as me. And if I spring up, build my nigga on the side of me. Ready for a war? 